Hi, I'm LaShawn and welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here and you want to be inspired on a daily basis, then this is the perfect place for you. Start now by subscribing and clicking the bell. Hello, hello. My name is LaShawn and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is a very simple lifestyle vlog where I get here every morning and I try to uplift, encourage, and inspire as many people as I possibly can. Let me tell you a little bit about myself. I am the divorced mother of three adult children. I have two boys and a girl. I am a United States Navy veteran. I'm also a surgical tech. I am disabled and I work full time here now from my home. I am a hustler. That's right, I'm a hustler. I get up every day and I work. I do something for my YouTube channel every single day and I love what I do. I love to help people, uplift people, encourage people and talk about the love of the Lord. That's right. So this is my new intro. So here I am, <laughs> and if you like what you see, click like, share, comment, and come back here on a daily basis. So, here's today's video. Okay, YouTube, as you can see, I am here at feet first. Let me see if I can get, I don't know how to get, there it is. I'm at feet first, as you can, wait, it's, it's this way, uh, let's see how you, Point the finger. Feet first shoe store. And this, let me explain while I'm here. So I have to go to a specialty store that is um, equipped for diabetic shoes. This store is on the list of places you can go uh, when you get a referral from the VA that custom make your shoes if you're diabetic. Uh, when I say custom made, the shoe itself you get the shoes, but they make uh, personal insult, uh, inserts for your feet and for each particular pair of shoes. And I'm diabetic, so I get uh, where they do a mold. I said I was going to tape it this time, but I don't know what's wrong with me today. I usually, if I have a sniff or anything, I try not to come out. I sneeze so much inside my mask that my mask was wet in the inside so it didn't do me no good and they don't have any masks here I just came outside because uh, somebody in there I'm not sure what it is but I keep sneezing and so I just wanted to get some air because I just finished uh, doodle you have to try the shoe on make sure they got your right size see if they got to order them and then you have to put your foot in it looked like a, a shoe box where a, a pair of new shoes come in, but then it pushes down like that, like quicksand, and it firm, it um, makes an imprint of your feet. And then they make uh, personal inserts for your shoes. And it's a, it's really a good thing, and it's, it molds to your feet. And it's a blessing. That's why I always say, I'm not complaining. I'm always looking for solutions. And my best solution is my podiatrist. He is so proactive and he's a good doctor. He take really good care of my feet, calluses, toenails, fingernails, and uh, trying to get a wrap around all of my circulation and neuropathy situations because I'm diabetic. I'm not gonna wait until they tell me that, you know, I'm having problems with my feet or toes and they need to amputate something. I'm not even gonna speak that into existence. I'm proactive and I've always been like this. I had, my mother had diabetes, my father had diabetes, my grandmother had diabetes, but my father was the worst case because he was a non-compliant diabetic. And I say that because he was non-compliant. He did what he wanted to do until gangrene set in on his toes. Then they amputated his toes, and then they amputated his foot. Then they amputated below the knee. He was out of control. And before he died, that other foot was just looking horrible. And I, I think it's a blessing that I got to see different stages of neuropathy, different stages of gangrene. Uh, what can happen if you, uh, 
don't do what you're supposed to do. You don't eat right. You know, you continue to smoke and different things like that when you are diabetic. Now, I'm not no doctor, nothing. I just got a lot of other stuff going on. And my thing is, I want to be here for my children. I uh, am young. I have no grandchildren yet. And I want to live. I want to live. I want to be productive. And part of that is coming here to feet first, uh, shoes, and coming when I have to and order shoes, special shoes for my feet. Also, I get diabetic socks. Now, everybody got their thing, oh, those are, oh, them socks are ugly, whatever. Yeah, well, they, they can be ugly, but they help with my circulation. And I don't walk barefoot. I walk with my socks around the house. So I don't want to step on anything. I don't want no sores. And these are the things that I do to be proactive, to take care of my feet. So I wanted to share this adventure with you today. Now, I was in there once. I'm going to go back in. Uh, it's, it's a lot of veterans in there. And it's not a big it's not a big store because they only cater to referrals. So you somebody from the street wouldn't walk in and buy shoes. That's not how they operate. They only got, you know, the display models in there. But you have to come in with a referral from either a podiatrist or, you know, somebody who's um, uh, I guess your primary. I don't know. I always get my referral from the uh, podiatrist. I've never got a referral from my primary. So I guess it depends on what your insurance is because, uh, you know, depending on your insurance, that's who would refer you. So I have to go back in there and finish my write-up and then JTA will come and pick me up and take me back to the house. Now, I want you to remember something. I don't know what your medical condition is or whatever. I share the fact that I'm diabetic. I share the fact that I take care of my feet and I'm hoping and praying that this video will help somebody who maybe they just learned they're diabetic or maybe they just learned that they have neuropathy or something's going on. And, um, you know, the, the little stinging or uh, the, the, the irritability of the pain that shoots up your legs and your feet. I hope and pray that you're not suffering. But my thing is do what the doctor says. And I was, these diabetic socks are not very attractive. They long and I wear compression socks and I do whatever I got to do. I, I don't have any Velcro on my hands either, you know, because I wear compression socks. I don't want any blood clots, anything that'll take me out. Okay, I'm trying to be here for a while. Besides, I ain't been back to Disney. I want to go to Disney. Okay. Uh, okay, so that's it. That's all I got for you. I'm going to go back inside and finish up this video, and I'll talk to you again after I get on the JTA and take me home. And then it'll be time for me to eat and everything. Now, I was going to walk and go get something to eat in this little thing, but I have, I don't have the strength. I'm, I got to go finish up in there, go to the bathroom. By then, my ride will be here, okay? So I thank you for joining me today. Okay, so I've already... um finished up and I picked out the shoes that I'm going to get and uh, they're going to order them and I'll have my shoes within two weeks and so now it's time for me to head home Good. okay at this time we're going to breathe in and breathe out and get our day started you ready breathe in breathe out We thank you, Father, for another day. We are so internally grateful, Father God. We woke up this morning. Thank you for that, Father God. We know that there are some people hungry. We know that there are some people who didn't wake up this morning. So we thank you, Father. We give you all praises. Okay? So wherever you're headed today, wherever you got to go, to work, to school, maybe you have a doctor's appointment, it doesn't matter. Be happy. Be joyful. Put a smile on your face and treat people with respect. It's the only way to live, okay? So have a good day. Have a blessed day. And remember, God loves you, and so do I. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.
Thank you guys for watching today. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Take a minute to leave a comment. I look forward to talking to you soon.